a return to time compared to the third and we got to the completely void. So, Lee, there's some evidence that some crimes would reduce if sentences were longer. Yeah, I don't think, I think things like murder, you know, a lot of murders are not premeditated in the strictest sense of the word, you know, it's a lash out, yeah. a moment of anger, etc. It might stop that, that's the redness, whatever you want to call it, yeah. Um, what I advocate is that if you give a longer sentence, it's a deterrent to the person who is crime. So the idea is you're trying to say for the next generation, do not do it, this will happen to you. With regards to the amount of crimes dropping down, have you tried to report crime? Have you ever tried to report crime? They do anything they can to stop you from that crime. They will try and persuade you. Oh, you can dig in your hands, but they will persuade you to because obviously the stats will reflect quite badly on them. I was stopped in my local park uh, some years ago by three coppers who were asking what we thought of the policing in the park. And I was a car, we got away from the kid. Then they have a look at the city park and see what happens. Why don't you go to the roof of the bike where you steal a phone and you lose your hand? It's amazing that how, how few things get sold. I mean, exactly. But Apparently it's that severe. I mean, obviously, after they get caught the second time, they never get caught again because they don't leave any fingerprints. Most of them die in old age. I don't know what the number of to your first sentence. But the, the point is, I just think that the other reason for the longer sentence is, is if you give a shorter sentence, people always say, oh, the cost of putting prisoners in prison. There's a cost of processing them in, processing them out, the legal cost, the cost of everybody. But there's also the truth. Oh, Surely in a country yeah. where there's a 20th sentence of crime. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but I'm saying just to see if it will happen. What's that living in a kind of... What is it? Is it like living in a state that maybe where no cars get stolen? Perhaps. Maybe we put three or four away. The rest of the society goes, I'm not doing that anymore. We've sold that money. Do you know what I mean? I'm just saying if we no. tried it to see what would happen. Oh, it would be unfortunate for a person who gets pulled yeah. away. However, and then the face yes, the Facebook rises and they're four years uncomfortable here in this land. I know, I'm kind of nice. Two, a two-year sentence is cheaper 
if we're looking at it in monetary terms, is cheaper than two one-year sentences and the crimes that are committed sure. in between sure. the two one years. Sure. Okay, you're getting me thinking. I still don't want to live in your weird little country. <laughs> well, I suspect a few people at home will. Uh, let's find out, we had Tony online. Good morning, Tony. Good morning. Do you want to live in Lee's Fantasy Island? No, I certainly don't. It's not a good deal to me. Um, I, I thought it had been true. Um, I was just 18 months of fraud a few years ago. Um, I knew after one day it wasn't for me, and to here, there is no way I was going to be perfect for life of crime. However, So every year, it'd be 20 years, no parole. Would you have still done it? Yes, it was a premeditation in the entire way. It was a temptation, and I didn't think of the consequences at the time. So, so, so when, when Lee is saying that if he publicised it, so that everybody would know that these big, big sentences were coming through, that actually in your case, even all that after all that effort of trying to get the message out there, it's going to be 20 years, that wouldn't have deterred you. It would have served me to make it hard. Why do you think that? I can think the consequences of what I'm trying to say. But is it because you didn't think the consequences because you knew there weren't very severe consequences? No. If you did not see, I think what you're saying there, Tony, I don't want to go into what you actually did, mate, that's up to you, but you, you've done something, you said it was opportunistic, was that right? Yeah, it's, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, what it's, it's, yeah. So something presented itself to you and you thought, I could do that. I suppose in what the illustration I was just saying is if there was a car there with the keys in and the engine running and nobody around, would you see it if you know you could get 20 years? Yeah, well, that's okay. It's just two things. It's not on wood, because I've never expected to see the car. For what purpose is that? It's just been to me in no way at all. 